on to another subject. This past week, out in Hawaii, the National Football League owners passed by the very narrowest of margins to once again utilize instant replay. That discussion, now to be discussed by a panel of experts, instant replay, the pros and cons here on the World Wrestling Federation. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight we come down from the top rope to address an issue that's currently rocking the very foundation of the World Wrestling Federation. Instant replay. One of the most controversial rules in the National Football League and an issue which WWF President Jack Tunney has been forced to consider. What transpired at the Royal Rumble in Miami was absolutely abominable. The interference by the macho King Randy Savage was both blatant and brutal. From the perspective of many here in the World Wrestling Federation, had instant replay been in effect, the Ultimate Warrior would currently reign as WWF Champion. With me tonight via satellite, a couple of champions in their own right, Yankee owner George Steinbrenner and NFL analyst Paul McGuire. George, let's begin with you. Well, let me tell you, President Jack Tunney and I go back quite a ways. In fact, after the Royal Rumble, we got together at my condo in Boca Grande and had a chance to hash out this instant replay thing. Frankly, after hours of careful consideration, I'd have to say I'm for it. The only problem I see lies with the replay officials themselves. It drives me absolutely nuts when they dilly-dally around about an obvious call. However, let me offer a possible solution. If a replay official takes more than 60 seconds to make a call, you fire him on the spot. Wait a minute, George. What do you mean, fire him? Like, from his job? You guessed it. Sayonara. Adios. Don't let the door hit you in the butt on your way out. Uh-huh. Well, it sounds like that JR School of Management there, George. Hey, Paul McGuire, maybe you can provide us with some insight concerning instant replay. I was a player's player in the NFL, and I always will be. If you are the rules and regs, the better I always say. Remember in 70 during the Bills-Redskins game when I was suspended for eye gouging? Man, I couldn't believe it. I understand, Paul, but I think we're talking about the WWF here. Yeah, I know, and I say let them wrestle. This incident at the Royal Rumble is all a bunch of crap. Come on, guys, suck it up. Play hurt. You know what I'm saying. Uh, excuse me, could I interject here? Now, if you watch a replay of the championship match closely, it becomes painfully clear the referee just isn't doing his job properly. A possible solution? Fire him. You know, pull the rug out, out the door. Now you're talking. Oh, man. What a butthead. What? What was that? Did I just hear someone call me a butthead? No, George. All I was saying was those were the great days when all I had to do was strap on a helmet and butt heads. I don't believe it. And furthermore, you never butt heads with anyone. In fact, you weren't even a real player in the NFL. You were a punter, and a punter that no one remembers. Now, you take someone like Daryl Yapremian. There's a punter to remember. Whoa, now, gentlemen. Let's go to our neutral corners and cool off a minute. And while we're at it, let's clear up this little controversy. What do you say we go to the instant replay? All right, I guess that's a good idea. But wait a minute. Let me get a clock on these guys. Oh, man, this isn't good. All right, while we're waiting, let's have a quick look at the reverse angle replay. Oh, man, what a butthead. Well... From the reverse angle, there seems little doubt Mr. Steinbrenner's call is the correct one. Surely, this should be no problem for our <clears throat> officials. 48, 49, 50, 51. I still don't know, What do you do to the staff thing here, 60, 61. Hi, gotcha. You're out of here. Wait, wait, wait. I think we have a ruling. He did it or not. I don't know whether he did it or not. Have a look at this oh, camera, boy. Look at this one. Here, After look. further review, the replay is inconclusive. Therefore, the play stands. Inconclusive? Inconclusive, my eye. Who are these two? They'll be on the streets by sundown. I'm sorry, but it seems like we've run out of time. I'd like to thank our distinguished panel of experts for shedding new light on this critical issue of instant replay. And should our esteemed President Jack Tunney be watching out there, I'm sure he'd have to admit that the trouble with instant replay seems to be there's nothing instant about it. I'm Vince McMahon.